I'm sitting on my traditional country. This is where my history is, going right back four generations. This is where I belong. We all were traumatised by the experience of being in Sister Kate's and being taken away. There was a picture of an angel on the wall at Sister Kate's and all I did was just look at this angel on the wall. When I got to the Foster family, they gave me paper and pencil and paints and I started to draw this angel. Because out of that place, that was the only beautiful thing. There was nothing else. All I wanted to do was tell the story of Stolen Generation. I don't care if it doesn't sell. I have to do it because it's, it's my story. It's my mum's story. It's very, very hard to sit for 10 years and paint that story when it's my family that experienced it. Because I know what it's like for everyone out there who have suffered, who've been taken from their country, their culture, their community and their families. It's the celebration of our survival. That's the kind of passion that keeps you going, keeps you young, keeps you motivated. Passion for justice. And art is the only vehicle that I know of that doesn't alienate others from understanding this story. And that's why I do it.